I wonder if you can hear her. You can hear Lilian. You can hear Lilian. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Is this audible Good to afternoon. everybody? Okay, Madame Lilian Nazar again is the president of the Canada Lebanon Chamber of Commerce and Industry. عندهم اهتمام بترويج للصناعة اللبنانية برا. نحنا باللانش اور رح نفتح زوم كولز بال بزنس لاونج right next to your lunch and there's going to be members of the board of the eminent CCICL uh, answering your questions. I've already alerted the industrialists before whoever wants to line up for that. بس هلا uh, Mrs. Lilian would like to address us uh, uh, directly with something that she would like to say, probably to foster our belief in furthering the efforts that we're, we're doing for Lebanese industry. The floor is yours. Good afternoon, everybody. We are Tikkun al It's an amazing thing what's happening right now in Beirut. Yani we had a few people from our members today. They're trying to go on live to see this great event launched by Paragon with Lubnani. Um, the Lebanese Chamber of Commerce was uh, uh, created in 1989. Uh, it's English or French or uh, Arabic. Uh, can everybody hear me correctly? Yes, yes, we can hear you properly. Okay, so the Lebanese Chamber of Commerce and Industry is a, an organization, a non-profit organization was created in 1989 to help mobilize the Canadian and Lebanese who lives in Canada or in the United States, because back then there was not, nothing else except in Canada. We, uh, it was launched on, a, on, on the hand of, a, uh, I'm going to say, a, a category of business people who wants to relate between Lebanon and Canada. And everybody can hear you properly and encourage the development on opportunities in both countries. What we have done in the past is how we looked into the future. And in Mission Tavolitna Lyon, it's evolving. And we have launched in the last two years uh, a lot of initiative with many, many uh, organizations in Lebanon, whether it's the industry or uh, agriculture or uh, Anna Mondrektir in Canada, in, in the Canadian uh, acronym, they're very interested in seeing how we can, I'm going to say, adopt this initiative to help probably build a bridge between Lebanon and Canada. I think there's a lot of opportunity that we missed on in the last few years. The private sector is probably, the, we can say, the savior of our economy in Lebanon. So I don't want to go furthermore, but I want to salute you, uh, Dalia, for this great initiative. I think it's a great uh, opportunity for us to see how many women in leadership, they're trying to help Lebanon, to uh, probably to increase the visibility in North America. I'm Yamil Echo, yes. I think the, the quality of the audio is not too great, but we have heard you very well. What is it required from us? How do you see and foresee how we can help as a Canadian Chamber of Commerce? Land of Bari, Fiktir organization in Lebanon, they tried to build that bridge between Lebanon and Canada, especially with Ita Al Khas. There were some success stories. Contribution between the two countries. They're trying to find opportunities to find probably to help people in the uh, outsourcing, whether in exports, whether in imports. Hello, uh, Mr. Christian Rabat, one of our members of the board of directors. Yes, absolutely. I wanted to be a Christian, but I can't not take a look at Christian. Can I have a Exactly. I'll, I'll leave the floor to Christian so he can uh, introduce himself and 
Christian, hello, hello, Peak. Thank you for joining us today in Lebanon's industrial parade, and thank you for pushing this forward from day one, whether through the chamber or on a personal level. We always owe it to you as Lugnani because you were the first to spot us from outside Lebanon, and even before we went live. Thank you, Christian, and the floor is yours. Well, thank you, Dalia. No credit to, to take here. You are the, uh, the heart and the soul of Paragons, and uh, all this initiative is you. So uh, I only picked up uh, what you started, and uh, the Chamber is very proud of, uh, of what's going on, and uh, we'd like very much to, uh, to lend a helping hand. So basically what we're uh, trying to achieve here is see how we can uh, reach. Uh, Lilian just, uh, I think, explained it. Plain and simple, uh, chambers are here to assist entrepreneurs, industrialists uh, um, to, uh, to bridge. And our network is, uh, is there for you, uh, both in Canada and maybe we can do also some leverage in the States. So uh, that's the idea. And whoever uh, needs our assistance, we're here to help through uh, uh, programs, uh, mentoring. This is uh, probably uh, Lilian did not mention that, but in the chamber we, uh, we initiated a program for mentoring. People who want, especially entrepreneurs, who want to start up as well uh, a bridge or a, uh, a startup here in Canada, uh, we're here to assist in the startup uh, by also promoting mentoring programs, uh, which is very uh, I would say important uh, when people come in, don't know how to, uh, uh, to, uh, to promote their companies and, and to start the companies basically. So that, that's the reason why we initiated the mentoring program. Uh, we do not want uh, to have uh, you know, uh, entrepreneurs or, or people coming from Lebanon without any assistance. We want them to be uh, French, we say encadré, we, you know, uh, uh, basically wow. that's the idea of, of a mentoring program. Uh, so that's it. Uh, I'm an, an engineer by, by trade and a businessman by, uh, you know, by my active profession. So I know the tricks of the trade here. So basically uh, I'm heading the mentoring program at the chamber. And uh, uh, for everyone who has any questions in the... Uh, in for the mentoring or any other uh, uh, idea that they want to throw for export or anything, we're here to assist. And I think you're initiating some kind of a uh, of a room for us uh, for any people who want to have a one-to-one -one chat. Or is that the program, Madame Khali? Yes, that is in fact the program. Uh, we have a, a, a couple, actually more than okay. a couple of industrialists lined up to talk to you in the business lounge. So if you can just uh, stay online with us. Um, for the moment. I want to thank you both. I want to thank you for the thrust forward and for the positive thinking and for always pushing our initiatives ahead. Thank you Lilian and Christian for joining us today. It makes a big difference to know that you're always there. Thank you. Keep your heads up guys. Thank you.